Hey everyone, Amber from The Vault here. Welcome back to more Cozy Grove. We're gonna go ahead and just jump right back in. So I'll see you guys back in just a sec. All right, everybody, here we are. We're back again in the most wonderful game of all, Cozy Grove. I'm so excited. I, I have to be honest. So I went through and I did a lot of the like normal pickup stuff today. So I went ahead and I mined a little bit. I dug some things up, but I did nothing as far as any of our friends, our little bears. I haven't trick-or-treated, any of that kind of stuff. So I kept all of that for you guys, but I'm so excited because I'm gonna be able to go and actually play the game now. So I had to skip yesterday, unfortunately, because I was actually very sick. Uh, it was not very fun. So I apologize that there will be days here and there that maybe I may not, uh, I may not be able to do anything, but I'm doing my best to try to get every day in. So I do apologize about that. But today that means we can go ahead and pick some stuff up. We can go ahead and communicate with our different little friends. And of course, we can try to talk to Ma. Come on, come here. There we go. <laughs> we can try to talk to Speaker of Truth. Ooh, I like the name of that one. Um, I caught one the other day that was Death to the Patriarchy, and I thought that was pretty funny. Um, let's go ahead and talk to these two. So we've got, so this is why I was confused the other day, because this lady who's fancy and has the dead uh, whatever on her, the skull, she had come and visited, but she only visits on whatever day of the week this is. I can't remember. I think it's a Saturday. She only visits on Saturdays, and that's why I was confused when this pumpkin dude showed up, because I wasn't expecting no t pumpkin dude to show up, but... We got this figured out now. So we can go ahead and talk to her first. All right. My endless torment on this godforsaken, glorified sandbar is your game, darling. By the end of today, you'll be... Wait, you'll look as striking as any scout ever has. Fabulous. Well, the first thing we want to do is look at the wigs. Let's see what we've got. Oh, we do have some pretty wigs. Now, I don't think I'm ever going to buy any of these because... I like my hair. And this is actually what my hair kind of looks like. The only thing is the color is wrong, <laughs> but otherwise it's pretty much my hair. Uh, so, ah, oh, the indignity. There is some sort of shellfish in my shoe. Is this hell? Surely no decent purgatory is cursed with shoe shellfish. You look untroubled. Ah. Uh. Of course you do. Such an adorably quaint little scout. You brighten my day, dear. <laughs> Let me have a look at you. Let's do this. Can I help you with something? I'm an artist in need of a canvas, and that canvas is you, dear. Trust me, you'll look marvelous in these. All right, so what do we need? Let's see, we need an orange warm accessory scarf and elegant glasses. Hmm, we already have the hair. So let's go talk to him. Uh, or her, sorry. This, I forgot, it's Ms. Caruse. All right, I've never understood why most of the world celebrates Halloween for just a single day. It is the best of holidays. We celebrate it for days here in Cozy Grove. Let me help you get into the swing of things, little mortal. And of course, we already know that we have uh, all this stuff we can buy and we need to kind of pick up from her. First things first, though, I do have enough spooky rotten eggs to grab the spooky squid, spooky critter scroll. I don't know why that's so hard for me to say, but it is. So now that we have it, we're going to be able to use it, I'm assuming, but I'm very excited about this. All right. So thanks to you, the spirits of Cozy Grove will finally enjoy a proper All Hallows' Eve. You must dress up for them, little mortal. It's tradition. All right. So we're going to go ahead and buy some things. So first things first. Oh, I haven't looked at my pumpkin patch today. Hmm. That is something to think about. So 300 is still what we are looking for when we have enough of the, uh, the candy corn. Okay, let's see. We've got clown makeup. No, thank you. Uh, oh, a different shark hood. Yeah, I'll buy that. I like shark hoods. I think they're funny. Let's say no for now. Just because I want to see what else we can get. Oh, demon cat hood. Oh, yeah. We're in. We're in. And we're wearing it now. Okay. So there we go. We've got a demon cat hood on. So we're going to have to go to our wonderful friend Kit and buy some more clothing. We need to make sure we have whatever she needs. Okay, hold on. Wait a minute. What do I need? Orange warm accessory scarf. Hmm. Elegant glasses. And it has to be all those things, right? 
I don't have a scarf. What if there is none? Is there a way to just not do anything for her? Let's see. Clothing, formal, glasses. Because it has to be all of the things, right? I'm gonna buy this anyway, just to see. Let's just see. This doesn't count, right? No, okay, because it has to be elegant glasses. Okay. Well, I figured I'd check, just to make sure. So let's go to Flaney. I did buy what is probably my favorite dress so far. Uh, doo -doo -doo. It's this little dress. I love this. All right, so let's see. What do we have scarf-wise? Oh, we have an orange scarf, I guess. Fabulous, darling. All right, and then I guess we have some elegant glasses. Okay. I guess we already had those things. Good. Hopefully she always picks things I can get. Hmm, not what I expected. It's even better, darling. You look magnificent. Please don't thank me. Your look of adoration is thanks enough. Really? Really? I don't think it's thanks enough. Leather trench coat. Ooh, okay. I'm, I'm into that. All right, so what I want to know is what you want from me, because please tell me to go trick-or-treating. The spirits of this island would be delighted to see you dressed up for All Hallows' Eve. So let's go get dressed up for All Hallows' Eve. Oop, here we go. Ah! ah. Okay. And what, do we, what all do we need? Um, any face mask and any hat. That is festival, of course. Check out clothing. All right, so let's take a look. Ba -ba -bum. I mean, I would really prefer if I could get like a decently, yeah, let's put that on. The only thing is, the only face masks we have are these. I have this one and then I have this one. And they don't really go with the cat outfit. It sucks. And I don't want the clown makeup. Hmm. I don't know how to feel about this. I really don't want those on. I don't want any of those on. Um, I purposely don't wear glasses in real life. I guess we could look again at the stupid clown makeup to see what it looks like. Hmm. Maybe it doesn't actually look like clown makeup. Ugh. Oh, no, it does. It does. I hate it. Okay. So we're gonna have to go as a happy bear. We don't have any other choice. It kind of sucks, though, because it's like... I don't really want to... I don't know. I don't really want to cover up my, my demon cat hood. I think it's so cute. Alright. Let's see. This works, right? Wait, what? Uh, oh, I need, oh no, I need specific things. I feel like an idiot. No, I have to buy the clown hat. I have to buy it. I hate you, Miss Bruce. I hate you. I don't want to wear that. I don't want to wear it. I guess if you, if you have the hat, hmm. If you have the face mask on, it does kind of look like a nurse bear. So maybe I'm a nurse bear. That's what I'm going to convince myself I am. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I can go trick or treat. But can I trick or treat with her? I wonder. Can I say trick or treat to you? Ugh, honestly, what is even the point of this island? No restaurants, no boat clubs, not a single solitary theater. I'm bored, darling. I need a project. Consider yourself fortunate. Trick or treat! Oh, what a surprise. How delightful. This deserves a special treat. Hee hee! Trick or treat, trick or treat, trick or treat! Wait, I don't want a feather boa. I want candy. Give me some candy. I can't ask Flamey for candy, can I? No, I didn't think so. It would be fun, though. Okay, we don't have enough to get that stupid shovel. I really want that shovel. But, okay, trick or treat, you say? You're leaving it up to me? But here you go. I hope it's everything you wanted. Yeah, candy. We've got to get to 300 candy. We've got to get to 300 pieces. I don't know why I'm singing. Oh. <laughs> Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, self. You gotta slow down. I'm getting too excited. Whee! Money, money, money. 
All right, let's go. So let's make sure we talk to everybody too. We'll just hit them up for both our candy and our things. So trick or treat. I'm definitely on the treat side of the spectrum, bright eyes. Sad to report that I'm all out of barnacle swirls and glassy taffy though. Perfect. Ooh, oh, we got quite a bit of spooky rotten eggs out of her. Thank you, Allison. All right, so how you doing, Allison? Hey there, bright eyes. Seems like you're becoming a bakery connoisseur. So would you like to know the secret of my success? I guess? Well, a lot of people will tell you that baking is about precision and rules. You know, two cups flour mixed by hand, use the oven instead of the microwave. But I know better. Baking is about love. When you put your heart into your work and serve it with a smile, it just tastes better. At least I hope so. Because sometimes I mix up sugar and salt. <laughs> because, uh, okay, um, that, uh, might kill the mystery for me? Oh, wisely said. A good mystery is a thing to be savored. You know, I just love chatting with you, bright eyes. To be fair, I adore almost everyone in this town. That doesn't make you any less special. Oh. Well, thank you, ma'am. But... I can't do anything for you today. Uh, sometimes when I'm in a hurry, I use certain pre-made ingredients to speed things up. Oh, really? For example, the holiday cake I threw together last year. I think we I remember reading this. Angel food cake, a can or two of icing mixed with cinnamon, then filling in the middle, canned apple pie filler. Don't forget the piece de results. Seeds from whatever squash you have on hand. Yeah, we read that one before. But I have to say... I actually think everything but the seeds sounds pretty good. I kind of want to make that just to see how it actually is. Okay, one thing I want to do real quick. Let's... Where is this? To summon some spooky critters. Okay. <gasps> oh! Oh my gosh! Oh my god! Spooky critters just arrived! Okay, so I'm gonna guess that we can get multiples of those. I'm so excited. Did it only bring one spooky critter? Or are there other spooky critters? Ah! Of course he got away from me. Because I was too busy looking up there. <gasps> yes! I see another spooky critter! Okay, I'll grab you. But in the meantime, I'm so excited. Another spooky critter! Yes! A headless beetle, except I can see its head. That's okay. I'm not here to judge. <laughs> I'm just so excited! Okay, okay. Okay, we gotta go find all those spooky critters! Oh my gosh, look at you! Look at you! Oh, shoot. <laughs> Don't look at you. Okay, what are you? Scroll mimic? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, we have to get more spooky eggs for sure ah! i'm so excited you look like a bat oh my gosh night flapper oh my god i'm so excited <laughs> this is so ridiculous how excited i am ah! okay so one of the things that i'm i'm really looking forward to with cozy grove is i did not realize that cozy grove was gonna have like holiday updates I'm not going to be able to catch this dumb thing. Does it follow you? Oh my gosh, what? Okay, I didn't realize that they, they were going to have holiday updates. So I'm like super excited about that. Oh, I scared it away. Um, sorry. I, I'm so excited about these. I'm like not even paying attention to myself. Um, I didn't realize they were going to have all these holiday updates, I guess is what I'm trying to say. So. Because they have- oh my god, it's Thing! It looks just like Thing! Oh, oh. Um, I'm excited to see what the future ones look like. Because that means there's probably going to be ones for like Christmas and stuff. And that's going to be dope. I'm going to love that so much. If you don't know, I'm obsessed with Christmas and everything about Christmas. Oh my god, I got it, I got it. Yes! Imp Parasite! Ooh. Oh, 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 I ran out of room. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> I have got to calm down. Oh my god, what the hell are you? Oh, you're the jack-o'-lantern one. Yes! Give me another jack-o'-bug. Ah! 
How did I not catch you? Um, there we go. Now, I wonder if I have to give these to the sea captain or not. Yes, I do. Okay, 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 okay. Ah, sorry. I know I'm, like, repeating myself so much, but I'm just so excited. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm so excited. We'll get, we'll, we'll archive it later. So here's the thing. I think these are only going to be here for tonight, is my guess. So I probably have to, like, catch as many as I can today, I'm guessing. Because I'm probably going to lose these critters pretty soon. There's the scroll mimic. Ah! I spooked him! Okay, I'm so excited. I wondered if this would just summon them, like, permanently or not, but it definitely seems like it's gonna summon them maybe once, and then we might have to do it again. Oh my god, I'm so excited either way. I know, I see you, Duclaw. I see you, Duclaw. I know, I know, I know. I'm just so excited about all the weird bugs. Here, do I have you yet? Oop, I don't know what I was doing there. I don't think I had that one yet. Oh my gosh, there are so many of them. There we go. Oh my gosh. This is easily the most fun I've had in a really long time. <laughs> Why the hell am I screwing this up? There we go. Okay. No, we can sell things to, uh, to, um, uh, 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 Valentina. Why did I forget your name, Valentina? What a wonderful costume! Take this and keep up the good work. Alright. A spooky egg. That's great. But what I really wanted was candy. Alright, can I help you with something? Oh, hi there, prospective voter. It's quite a lovely day in the, er, uh, it's another effing crisis that's what it's supposed to say i think is what it is neighbor Blah! oh my i'm sorry about that at first i'm sure i can explain and i can do it with dignity and restraint befitting of my position so a few real estate opportunities opened up in our town recently lovely my assistant bruce and i put together some high wait who is bruce do we ever get to see Bruce? I want to see Bruce. My assistant Bruce and I put together some signs highlighting those opportunities for lucky buyers. Let me guess, some imps took them. And then came the imps. Oh, those imps. They've stolen the signs and they've put them in the wrong yards. It could invite a full-blown real estate panic. Ah! If you could recover those signs quickly, citizen, well, you'd have the full support of my office. We can do that, but I also want to sell you some things because you just so happen to be convenient to me right now. So let's give you all the things that I know I can sell because I have already turned them in. All right, let's grab you. If you may, if, if you may, if you, if you have noticed is what I was trying to say in the lower section there that I have amassed a fair fortune in the meantime. I've done a pretty good job getting a good amount of money, and I'm hoping, this is a, a hope, that because I have this much money now, I'm going to be able to upgrade the tent very soon, but I'm also maybe going to be able to upgrade Mr. Kit's store, because apparently upgrading Mr. Kit's store is actually more uh, more worth your money, is, is what I've seen online but i don't know we'll see all right so cheerio super scout i'm still speaking regularly with your parents they agree the waiver you sign means they can't sue hurrah i told them i'm sure you're learning so much good times scoutmaster blake some ugly storms have been brewing out at sea no one is willing to make the crossing to cozy grove mr allen he lives by the docks said when lightning cracks you can spot some huge mournful beast rising out of the ocean depths i quote the color of the moon eyes of cold flame but wow this means you're lucky you get the whole island to yourself you are so lucky stay warm scoutmaster blake and yes, I totally realize I read some of those things incorrectly, but you know what? That's just who I am. All right, what do we have here? We have a common witch end table. We have a light. We have a feather boa still on us. Common log cabin fencing and also bamboo canopy bed. Oh, okay. Okay. So at least our spoopy stuff, we take over to our spoopy buddies. We can leave it over here. Now, this area definitely doesn't look that nice, but I'm not really worrying too much right now about what it looks like. Oh, oh, you don't like that because it's considered common? 
Okay, well, we'll move it next to the other one. <laughs> okay. Um, and then we've got that spotlight. Let's put that down here. I would like to move some light into this area. I'm not sure how it will impact. Ooh, wow, it's big. This is a really... It's a good light. Okay, that gave us a pretty good amount of light there. Okay. I am a fan. Okay, let's grab you real quick since you're here. Okay. And then... Let's come back to flamey because I know I have stuff in here I can get rid of. Where did I put? I don't even remember where I put the pumpkin and I feel very stupid right now. Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching me play Cozy Grove. If you like this video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, if you would like to subscribe to the channel and haven't already, go ahead and click on that picture of my big dumb face. You can go ahead and click that. Click on the bell icon if you would like to be notified every time I post a brand new video. Also, there should be on the screen there a couple videos that maybe you haven't seen, maybe you have, something that YouTube thinks you'd like, and something that I've put in there just for fun. Don't know what I did, but I put them in there in post. You can also click in the bottom left-hand corner. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot left from right. If you would like to support my Patreon, thank you so much to all of my Patreon patrons who really do keep this channel going, and especially with Cozy Grove, you guys are the reason I was able to actually get this game, so thank you so much for that, I really do appreciate it, and I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here, but I'll see you all in the next one.